Yeah, you know, second time around, you're you're always looking at some different things and 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 trying hard not to rely too much on what happened in the first one. Um, this one's even a little bit different because Bradley made the change five games ago, so we're it's almost like we didn't play him the first time. It's cool, and that's not always the case, right? I mean, it, usually uh, teams don't make this big a change during uh, in the 18 game schedule. Um, it happens; you see it from time to time, but. So it's almost like we didn't play this team the first time because of the change to their lineup and the way that they're playing right now. Uh, they had struggled in a couple non-conference games right before we went to see them. You know, they they, they were um, they weren't playing as good as as the, you know they knew they were capable of playing, and they are right now. You know, the way they've played in these in the five games is is uh, uh, they're good. I mean, they're they're uh, and they're playing as good as you know for the most part. You know, maybe there's a team or two that's. That's playing a little better, but for the most part, cool. They're playing just like everybody else. They're playing good right now. It was five games ago uh, when they made an adjustment to their lineup. Uh, they moved uh, uh, two new guys into the starting lineup, and now are bringing. Uh, uh, of course, those two guys are now coming off the bench that uh, that they're replacing the starting lineup. But that that adjustment to their lineup is so that they've won three of the five, so they've had success with it. Um, and in the two, they didn't win. You know, very competitive. They're. Um, more versatility in that starting lineup right now with uh, Von Bray uh, in with Childs at the four and five. Uh, both of those guys can play, uh, you know, can play on the three point line. They can both post you a little bit. They can both put it down a little bit. So just more versatility up front, and uh, uh, it, I think it's helped Brown. And, and uh, uh, he's he's really played well. His numbers in the last five have got he's shooting fifty four percent from the three point line in, in his last five games, and how that. How that is directly relates to the lineup change, Gary. I don't know exactly. I mean, they're running, you know, they run a lot of the same stuff. They've got some new things in there with this lineup, but they're running some of the same things as well. But that's a, you know, he's shooting 54% from three since they made that change. So not only has it impacted the, the guys up front and that versatility, but Brown, uh, Lundy, who went into the starting lineup, hadn't been playing much. And then uh, uh, D'Lo, uh, you know, he's, He's always been been a really good, really hard guy to play against. Uh, he's played better as well. So it, it just appears that uh, that they've got more guys that are that are playing uh, playing at a little higher level here since they made that change. You know, we we don't talk about the the standings. Uh, we don't put them up after every game. You know, we, that, that's not something that I've done. Um, as you guys know, I you know, and maybe you saw what uh, Edelman said. Last night, when somebody asked him if he ever thought he'd be the MVP, yeah, maybe you guys saw that he, he said, "I just wanted to have a great week of practice," and that's you know that you know, we've worked hard to have that be our deal. And so, in saying that, I look at him. I look at him for all the leagues. I mean, I the, I love it, man. I love seeing where teams are at. I, I look at ours. I know where everything is, right? Um, and I leave it up to the guys. I don't tell them, "Hey, don't look at the standings." Don't. I just don't talk about it. Uh, we talk about practice and getting ready for practice and, and uh, making sure we have a great practice when that, when that time comes. But um, as it's been with all of our teams, I'm sure that there's a handful of guys that, that look at them most every day or at least on the game days and see what happened. And there's a handful of guys that don't look at them too much. Um, and I'm good with either way. You know, I'm, I'm good with it either way, however they want to handle that.